Welcome to Walleye Country, Massachusetts Hidden Gems. Massachusetts might not be the first place that springs to mind when you think of walleye, but hidden beneath the surface of this historic state lies a network of lakes teeming with these elusive predators. We're diving deep into the heart of Massachusetts, uncovering the top 10 walleye fishing lakes that this state has to offer. So, pack your tackle box, grab your rod, and get ready for an adventure. Let's get started. Our journey begins at the mighty Quabbin Reservoir, the largest man-made body of water in Massachusetts. The sheer size of Quabbin can be daunting but don't let that intimidate you, it's that vastness that allows the walleye here to grow to monstrous proportions. We're talking real trophy fish, the kind that'll make your heart race and your line scream. The reservoir's depths and underwater structures create a complex ecosystem, one that requires patience and a keen eye to crack the code. Focus your efforts around drop-offs, submerged trees, and rocky outcrops. These are the hunting grounds of the walleye. Jigging with minnows can be deadly, but don't underestimate the effectiveness of crankbaits and spinners, especially during the low-light hours of dawn and dusk. Quabbin Reservoir is more than just a fishing spot. It's a pilgrimage, a test of skill against nature's cunning. Are you up to the challenge? Next, we venture to Lake Chalbuna Gungamaug, or Webster Lake as it's more commonly known, a place where history and angling intertwine. Generations of anglers have cast their lines into these waters, tales of their exploits passed down through families like precious heirlooms. The beauty of this lake lies in its diversity. From shallow weedy coves to deep cool drop-offs, Chalbuna Gungamaug offers a variety of habitats, each one teeming with walleye waiting to be discovered. Use your depth finder to locate humps, points, and channels. These are the walleye highways, the underwater paths they patrol in search of prey. Experimenting with crankbaits that mimic the lake's abundant perch and shad populations can yield impressive results. Remember, walleye are opportunistic feeders, so matching your lure to the local forage is crucial. Lake Shabunagungamog is a place where patience and persistence are rewarded. Now we journey to Pontusic Lake, nestled near the charming town of Pittsfield. Pontusic's calm, deep waters hold a special allure, a sense of peace that washes over you as soon as you arrive. But don't let the serenity fool you, beneath the surface, walleye patrol, their golden eyes watching, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. Focus your efforts during the early morning or late evening hours, when the sun dips below the horizon and the walleye rise from the depths to feed. Trolling with deep diving crankbaits can be incredibly effective here, allowing you to cover vast stretches of water and target the walleye's preferred hunting grounds. Pay close attention to your line, feeling for the telltale thump of a strike. Smaller jigs tipped with live bait can be deadly on Pontusic's walleye, especially during the colder months. Pontusic Lake is a place to escape the hustle and bustle of everyday life. Chapter 4, Onoda Lake a tranquil escape for walleye enthusiasts. Our next stop takes us to Anoda Lake, a hidden gem renowned for its crystal clear waters and a sense of solitude that's hard to come by. Onoda's pristine waters offer a unique challenge, allowing you to observe the walleye's every move, their shadows darting beneath the surface. One of the most effective techniques on Onoda is slow trolling with live bait. Rig a lively minnow or night crawler on a slip sinker rig and let it drift naturally along the lake's drop-offs and weed lines. Onoda's walleye are known to suspend in the water column, so adjusting your depth finder and finding the strike zone is crucial. Onoda Lake is a place where patience reigns supreme, so embrace the solitude, savor the scenery, and let the serenity of Onoda guide you to walleye success. Chapter 5, Cheshire Reservoir, the local favorite for walleye action. Get ready for some serious walleye action as we head to Cheshire Reservoir a local favorite known for its consistent fishing and the camaraderie of its anglers. Cheshire Reservoir's shallow areas provide the perfect environment for walleye to thrive, creating a haven for anglers seeking fast-paced action. One of the most popular techniques here is casting jigs tipped with soft plastic trailers. The key is to work the lure slowly along the bottom, mimicking the movement of a crawfish or other bottom-dwelling prey. Another effective method is trolling with crankbaits that resemble the reservoir's abundant shad population. Use your depth finder to locate schools of baitfish and focus your efforts in those areas. Cheshire Reservoir is a place where you can let loose, 
enjoy the camaraderie of fellow anglers, and experience the thrill of landing walleye after walleye. So grab your gear, join the excitement, and prepare for an unforgettable fishing adventure. Chapter 6. Wachusett Reservoir, a diverse playground for walleye hunters. Prepare to be amazed as we explore Wachusett Reservoir, a sprawling behemoth renowned for its diverse fish population and the challenge it presents to even the most seasoned walleye hunters. The sheer size of Wachusett can be intimidating, but it's that vastness that creates a unique and rewarding fishing experience. From rocky points to deep submerged humps, the reservoir offers a myriad of habitats, each one holding the potential for trophy walleye. Focus your efforts on the reservoir's many inlets and coves. Trolling with deep diving crankbaits or spoons can be incredibly effective, allowing you to cover vast stretches of water. Pay close attention to your depth finder, identifying drop-offs, ledges, and other underwater structures that walleye use for ambush. A lively minnow or night crawler presented on a jig or slip sinker rig can be deadly, especially during the colder months. Watches at Reservoir is a place to test your skills and experience the thrill of landing a trophy walleye. Chapter 7. Long Pond, Unveiling the Hidden Gem of Plymouth. Journey with us to Long Pond in Plymouth, a hidden gem tucked away from the hustle and bustle. Long Pond's calm, clear waters hold a special allure, a sense of tranquility that washes over you. Beneath the surface, a hidden world teems with life where walleye lurk, scanning the depths. Focus your efforts during early morning or late evening hours when walleye rise to feed. Casting jigs tipped with soft plastic trailers or live bait can be incredibly effective. Long Pond is a place to escape the ordinary and experience the quiet thrill of landing a walleye. Get ready for an unforgettable walleye adventure at Lake Cochituate, a sprawling oasis near Natick. It's a playground for anglers where you can cast your cares aside and embrace the thrill of the chase. Experience the satisfaction of landing a prized walleye. Its diverse ecosystem creates the perfect habitat for walleye. Trolling with crankbaits is effective here. Use your depth finder to locate bait fish. Casting jigs along weed lines is also productive. Lake Cochituate is a place to let loose, enjoy camaraderie, and experience the thrill of landing walleye after walleye. So, grab your gear and join the excitement. Don't let its size fool you. Laurel Lake may be small, but it's a haven for anglers seeking a peaceful escape and the chance to tangle with some surprisingly large walleye. This is a place where you can leave the crowds behind, reconnect with nature, and experience the quiet thrill of landing a trophy fish from a lake that's often overlooked. Laurel Lake's serene waters hold a special allure, a sense of tranquility that washes over you as soon as you arrive. During the warmer months, focus your efforts during the early morning or late evening hours, when the sun dips below the horizon and the walleye rise from the depths to feed. Casting jigs tipped with live bait or soft plastic trailers along weed lines and drop-offs can be incredibly effective. The key is to work the lure slowly, mimicking the movement of a wounded bait fish. Laurel Lake is a place to escape the ordinary, to embrace the solitude, and to experience the quiet thrill of landing a walleye. So pack your gear, leave the crowds behind, and discover the magic of Laurel Lake. Our final destination takes us to Otis Reservoir, a place where breathtaking scenery meets heart-stopping walleye action. This is a lake that has it all, from picturesque views to trophy-sized fish, making it the perfect place to end our journey through the best walleye fishing lakes in Massachusetts. Otis Reservoir's clear deep waters are home to a healthy population of walleye, and the lake's diverse ecosystem, with its mix of rocky points, submerged humps, and weedy bays, provides ample hunting grounds for these elusive predators. One of the most effective techniques on Otis Reservoir is trolling with deep diving crankbaits or spoons. Use your depth finder to locate schools of baitfish and focus your efforts in those areas. Another productive method is casting jigs tipped with live bait or soft plastic trailers along weed lines and drop-offs. Early mornings and late afternoons when the sun is low on the horizon are often the most productive times to target walleye on Otis Reservoir. Otis Reservoir is a place where you can escape the ordinary, reconnect with nature, and experience the thrill of landing a trophy walleye. So there you have it, the top 10 walleye lakes in Massachusetts, each one offering a unique and unforgettable fishing experience. 
From the sprawling expanse of Quabbin Reservoir to the tranquil beauty of Laurel Lake, these hidden gems hold the promise of trophy fish and memories that will last a lifetime. Take the time to appreciate the beauty of your surroundings, the serenity of the water, and the camaraderie of fellow anglers. These are the moments that make fishing so special, the moments that keep us coming back for more. Tight lines and happy fishing.